Have you ever noticed how your phone or computer seems to know exactly what you want before you even search for it? Or how social media always suggests posts that match your interests? What if I told you that artificial intelligence, AI, is behind all of this, predicting your every move? And here's the big question. In 2025, is privacy even possible anymore? Stick around as we dive into how AI is learning more about us than ever before and what it means for our privacy. Artificial intelligence has become a huge part of our daily lives today. It's not just a thing of the future. Every time you watch a video on YouTube, ask Siri for help or shop online, AI is working behind the scenes, making predictions about what you might do next. It analyzes your past actions like the videos you watch or the links you click to figure out what you'll want in the future. This kind of technology is amazing, but it also brings up a lot of questions about how much privacy we still have. But how does AI know what you want before you do? Have you ever been scrolling through your favorite shopping site and suddenly the perfect item pops up, something you didn't even know you were looking for? Or maybe you're listening to a song on Spotify and the next one is exactly what you wanted. This isn't magic, it's AI at work. At the heart of AI's ability to predict your every move is data. Every action you take online, whether it's browsing, clicking, or searching, adds to a giant pool of data about you. This data helps AI build a detailed profile of who you are, what you like, what you dislike, what time of day you're most active, and so much more. For example, when you shop online, AI looks at your past purchases, the pages you visit, and even how much time you spend on a particular product. By combining all of this information, AI can predict what you might be interested in next. And the more you shop or browse, the more accurate these predictions become. So what is the role of social media in predicting your actions? Have you noticed how social media platforms always seem to know what you're interested in? AI is constantly analyzing your interactions, like the posts you like, comment on, and share. From this, it creates a profile of your interests and suggests friends, groups, and even content you might enjoy. It's like having a personal assistant who knows exactly what you want to see next. But here's where things get tricky. While this makes our experience more enjoyable, it also means that AI knows a lot about us. And with all this knowledge, the question becomes, how much of our privacy are we giving up for the sake of convenience? Are you curious now how AI collects and uses your data? To predict our actions, AI needs data, lots of it. And there are three main types of data that AI collects. One, personal data. This includes things like your name, email address, location, and even your age or financial status. Every time you create an account or make a purchase, this data gets added to your digital footprint. Two, behavioral data. This is all about how you interact with technology. Every click, swipe, or video you watch adds to this data. AI uses it to figure out your preferences and predict what you might do next. Three, contextual data. This refers to the environment around your actions. For example, where you are when you're online, what device you're using, or even the time of day can all influence the kind of content or ads AI will show you. Once AI has all of this data, it starts to analyze it to make predictions. It looks for patterns and trends, so it can better understand what you're likely to do in the future. This helps AI provide you with personalized recommendations that feel more relevant and frankly, kind of amazing. Now, this is how AI learns and improves over time. AI isn't static. It learns and gets better over time. This process is called machine learning. As AI collects more data and analyzes it, it becomes better at predicting what you'll do next. For example, if you keep watching romantic comedies on a streaming service, AI will learn that you enjoy them and suggest more similar movies. The more you interact with AI, the more it can tailor its recommendations to your likes and dislikes. Natural language processing, NLP, is another important part of how AI predicts your actions. With NLP, 
AI can understand the context and intent behind the words you say or type. That's why virtual assistants like Siri or Alexa can understand your commands and respond in a way that makes sense. As AI continues to learn, it gets better at understanding you and anticipating your needs. Here's the big question. How much privacy do we still have if AI knows so much about us? Sure, it's convenient when AI predicts what we need, but it also means that our personal data is constantly being collected, analyzed, and stored. Many people don't fully understand how much of their information is being gathered or how it will be used. One of the major concerns is informed consent. How many of us truly read those lengthy privacy policies that pop up when we sign up for a service? Most of us just click agree without thinking twice. But are we really giving informed consent? Are we really fully aware of what data we're sharing and how it might be used? There are security risks of sharing data. As AI collects more and more data, the risk of data breaches grows. Hackers can target companies that store this sensitive information, putting personal data at risk. High-profile data breaches have already shown how vulnerable our information can be. If AI systems are compromised, sensitive details like your financial status or location could end up in the wrong hands. This is why data security is such an important issue. Companies that collect our data need to be held accountable for protecting it. But with AI getting smarter and collecting more information, the risks are growing. Could your personal information become a target for cyber criminals? That's a question worth asking. As concerns about privacy and data security grow, governments around the world are starting to take action. In places like Europe, the General Data Protection Regulation, GDPR, has set high standards for how companies collect and use personal data. The GDPR requires companies to get explicit consent before collecting your data and gives you the right to access or delete it. In the United States, the California Consumer Privacy Act, CCPA, gives California residents more control over their personal data. It allows them to know what data is being collected, opt out of data sales, and even delete their data. These regulations are a step in the right direction, but they only apply to certain regions. As AI continues to evolve, we'll need more global protections to ensure that our privacy is respected. Is privacy really dead in 2025? So what's the answer? Well, it's complicated. AI is making our lives more convenient, but it's also collecting more and more data about us. As a result, privacy is being challenged in ways we've never seen before. While there are laws in place to protect us, the rapid development of AI means that these protections must evolve too. The future of privacy in the age of AI depends on how we manage our data, how transparent companies are about their data practices, and how much control we as individuals have over our personal information. The next few years will be crucial in shaping how AI impacts our privacy. As AI continues to predict our every move and shape our digital lives, it's clear that privacy is becoming more of a challenge. It's up to us to stay informed and take control of our data. What do you think about AI and privacy? Are you worried about how much of your personal information is being collected? Let us know in the comments below. And if you found this video insightful, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more updates on how AI is changing the world around us. Stay informed and protect your privacy. It's more important than ever.